Hi guys, it's Taz here. I know you've been waiting for this quite eagerly. Finally, my next Skylanders video. <laughs> oh God, um, yeah, uh, Skylanders. Um, as you all probably know, I joined up with um, JT and Bokeh uh, a number of months ago. And um, when they had, I think they'd um, started up with Doll, Bloody, Fang, and Crumbles, and a few others, Prince, um, quite a few months ago. Um, I think JT and Poke died very much uh, where the game was first uh, introduced. Uh, Bloody shortly afterwards, uh, I think it was then Doll, and then about a month or two later, me and Steel, Steel joined in. Um, and it was an, a really good game. Yes, it had a lot of grind to it, but um, free to play could actually compete to a certain degree with pay to play. So it was very, very free to play friendly. So if you put the time and effort in, you could actually build up your heroes um, and actually do quite well in the game. Uh, yes, <laughs> evolving um, five star heroes, uh, getting up to six star. Uh, and all that sort of stuff was near impossible, but there were events that allowed you to get to that stage. Um, but then, I think it was a couple of months ago, um, the Come to Us decided to nerf the game completely, um, where you can no longer keep grinding in adventures um, to get uh, soul stones. In the past, what used to happen is you could grind as much as you like, um, getting soul stones of certain heroes. Every month or so, they would then change the heroes you could get within those adventures. Um, what uh, come to us in their wisdom decided to do was completely wipe that out and only allow you to get uh, one lot of soul stones, um, i.e. three, per uh, level so easy normal and hard um, so basically you can no longer grind there wasn't any point grinding anymore and uh, trying hard in the game um, a couple of months ago I actually uh, went up on holiday uh, for a bit um, informed the guys at one time that I was taking some time off and uh, if okay I'd like to stay there uh, on my return back, I noticed uh, I've been kicked um, without any warning. Uh, I wasn't given any, um, yeah, no notice whatsoever. So basically, I just quit at that point. I just couldn't be bothered to play the game anymore. So uh, I thought there wasn't any real point um, because I was guiltless. Um, but then uh, I think it was about a month or ago, uh, a few weeks afterwards basically, um, I started to get back into the game, I thought I'd try and see what was in there and um, would I recommend Skylanders to anyone? Uh, the answer to that would be categorically no uh, it, it's one of the uh, worst games at the moment <laughs> on the Android system uh, it's got nice mechanics uh, it's a good concept but is there any point at free to play playing this game? And the answer is no. Because at the end of the day, you can't get anywhere in this game without paying money. It's uh, far worse than uh, Castle Clash. Um, so you've got to contribute a lot of funds to actually build up your heroes now. Um, so why do I keep playing it? Um, I'm just hoping um, that come to us sees the light and decides oh yeah we'll revert it back to how it was um, because they are introducing free events here and there so there are events that take place which are pretty good uh, the last one was for um, <coughs> a five star plant guy a, a new dungeon and um, very easy to get and also build up to a certain level um, but uh, and they do other events from time to time where as long as you do your normal routine you're able to then spin a wheel or 
do other events and get certain types of stones, tickets, or whatever else you want. So, yeah, come to us are very good in that sense, I have to admit. But without without actually grinding um, in adventures, um, you can't get a lot of these soul stones. So, free to play are basically just dying. Uh, I'm now in a guild um, I think for the last month or so I've been in a guild um, who are top 30 or 40 um, and whilst I've been playing I've been offered places in a top 10 guild um, Titans was one of them and there was another one um, who wanted me to move over to there but at the moment because I'm only really just playing this very very casually I didn't see what the point is because they're basically forcing you into getting high guild war invasion scores um, boss battles and so on and to be honest <laughs> all I'm doing at the moment is I just put it on auto <clears throat> and uh, I'll probably spend half an hour max probably on this game and that's about it <clears throat> I wouldn't really want to invest any more time in this. I'm just hoping that they will change. Are you come to us? But I don't think that's ever going to happen. Um, but I thought, why not do... It could be my very last bid on uh, Skylanders. I don't know. But uh, I thought I'd probably uh, do something just to let everyone know. <clears throat> what the game's like. Um, the progression system. How I am currently uh, in terms of my heroes and so on. Okay, um, I've got to claim this. As you can see, I'm even locked on so far. Okay. Let's just uh, see. Look at these people. You can tell the game's dying. With a top ten guild, want someone like me to move over to them. Obviously, the game is dead. Um, now, look at this guy, 52 level, and he hasn't played for six days. That, that's very consistent now. Um, there's so many guys like this now that just uh, don't even bother playing the game. <clears throat> oh, there you go. It was great then. He was the one who uh, I think is the leader of uh, Titans and wanted me to come over. Plus I've had uh, someone else who was, I think, level 55 or who actually wanted me to come to their guild as well. And I think that was a, actually a top 5 guild. There you go, bloody still playing it, he's level 60. And his wife's still playing it. But they don't seem as active as they used to be. So, uh, anyway, let's do this. out of the way. So this is basically all I do in this game now. Oh, at least I've got something good. And the event that I'm talking about, the new one that's on currently, is this one here. So, uh, this, the, the normal ticket you can basically purchase uh, once a day. <clears throat> and then these are uh, ultra tickets. You can purchase them, um, well, as you can see, four for the week. Um, I don't buy anything else. Some of these stones will be nice. Um, uh, yeah, I don't really want to buy anything else, to be honest. Okay, and um, basically all I do... Oops, sorry. Uh, going to the guild, do my attendance, uh, 
See, they're very low rank. These guys are very, very low rank. Participation is really bad in this guild. Okay, uh, which one was it? So there's Titans. They're the ones that asked me over. I honestly can't recall who the other ones were. At the time, I think they were a top 5 or top 6 guild. So we're a 28. And let's see where my former guild is. Not even in the top 50. To be honest, one time is pretty much dead these days. Um, the build itself. We had, um, you know, everyone hoped it was going to do really well. And, uh, <clears throat> so there's sixth place here. We're 34. So, let's see where one time is in this. Oh, there you go. One time, 37. So, as you can see, uh, Shadow Fang. <laughs> Tell me that's Fang's uh, guild. Even though he's, uh, it's just... Okay. Um, so, really, all I'm doing now is I'll just press the start button and leave an aura and that's it because i can't be bothered to do anything else with this game anyway i'll pause it here in the past i have to admit i did actually try on this i did put the right runes on i did have the right heroes um so i actually wanted to try um but Recently, I just, I just thought, what's the point? I honestly do not see what the point of this game is, other than hoping Come to us will actually realise that this game is dying, and uh, they need to do something about it. And if they don't, this game will finish. Um, I think the European servers are pretty much dead at the, as they are, and the only ones. Uh, alive at the moment are the uh, American ones, the global. Um, yeah, so here's hoping. The other reason is I don't really want to, it, it's just like Castle Crash. I just don't want to take a long hiatus, hiatus, and uh, find out that afterwards, when I come back to it, I either can't remember how to play the game, or um, things are so different compared to where they were, it just doesn't seem viable anymore on actually playing the game. And I do actually like playing CC um, because there are different strategies you can use and uh, there are various game modes. In this, all you've really got are these stupid uh, boss battles. Um, if you've got the right heroes and the right runes, you can score triple S, like uh, I can't remember which boss it is now. I, I've got a score of uh, 180,000. Um, mm. But I can't recall uh, which boss that was, to be precise. But on these ones, and that was on auto. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm just hoping that Contours realise that they need to do something radical with the game. Um, at least bring back what, what it was like before and then add some other features to it. Other game modes as well and start getting people to start playing this game again. Because otherwise, um, yeah, this game is pretty much dead. Uh, anyway, I'll put this back on pause. Okay, looks like this is about to finish. Guild. So that's, I find that a chore to be honest these days. Um, 
on a huge chore. Okay, um, so once I've done that, um, what I then tend to do is either do arena. I don't do friendly matches anymore. Um, at all. Okay, let's just get these out of the way quickly. Okay, bear with me. I'm not sure if anyone's seen. I presume everyone knows what Skylanders is like. I won't show all of this. Uh, I'm just leaving it on auto for the moment. In later rounds, unfortunately, you can't leave it on there. <coughs> auto because the AI is just so bad. Drobot's still there, one of the best arena heroes it seems. Okay, I'm going to leave this on pause, I'll finish these off and come back to it. Okay, for some reason I decided to get, I'll have to fight this guy. These ones are try to oh, I'll leave it on auto still, but uh, keep getting to take all of all. That's why I meant um, certain certain elements here. You have to take it off uh, auto. Now I'm just going to put that back in pause. Okay, that's my final win. All I then do is collect the rewards. And I'm only after those. The legendary Omni Soul Stones times 10. Nothing else. Once I've done that, it's basically just the challenges. So, Mirage Shout, I did this yesterday. Uh, got up 69. I do struggle to get 70. I don't think I've ever managed to beat. Um, Mirage Tower is 70. They've got these uh, large golems and uh, they're near impossible to kill um, unless you spend the time and effort on your heroes, <clears throat> getting the right ruins uh, and all the rest of it. So, to be honest, I just can't be bothered. So, so all I do is this. Um, so, this is basic. My standard routine. Mm. So at the moment, there's those two elements. So you've got Arena and Mirage Shower. Okay, Mirage Shower outside of the reset periods. Reset periods, you do need to uh, be active, uh, you know, um, keep clicking on next and so on and fight the next bot battle um, but otherwise you just do that um, the nice thing is cave of gold and meditating woodlands don't require any uh, feedback from the user so 
so I then I tend to do the uh, ones that need some activity from the user. So I tend to do those first. Uh, let's just see. So this is the uh, plant guy I was talking about. They gave him away for free, or her, sorry, her, away for free. And let's just see how close, 26. Okay. And basically what I'll do with this, I'll just set it to auto. And that's it. And uh, an auto is normally good enough to get to me, uh, to get to like wave three, mm. floor three, level three, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> and this is purely just to get the blue ticket. Because nowadays you can't get uh, soul stones within uh, realm of cells. You get these blue tickets. You need five tickets to then be able to roll. So, uh, yeah, they have changed a lot within this game. Anyway, I'll put this on pause while I let the uh, AI continue with these battles. And then go from there. Okay, this is floor five now. Um, so... I tend to just use my better heroes for this. Um, not the best. Because really all I'm after to, in this, for this particular game mode is just to get a few tickets. And I've got so much energy. I'm not really fussed if uh, my heroes die and I'll go with this all over again. So I'm going to probably die with this, but then I've got other heroes I can actually use. So Okay, I'll just finish this, this one off. Okay, that's the end of that particular level. So basically that's as far as I take it, I don't go any further than that. So I've done my Realm of Souls, I'll do, just go into my ruins, pick any old ruin, it seems okay. Power it up three times, so that's one of the other missions. To be honest, I don't care about ruins anymore. In the old days we used to farm like anything with the dungeons. I don't do dungeons anymore. I don't do adventures anymore. Um, okay, so I've done the first two. Cave of Gold. Okay, I'll leave this in auto, so um, I'll just unpause it once it's all done. Okay, so that's the end of the, uh, I didn't do that well. <clears throat> I think the highest I've ever got from the Cave of Gold was something like 180, 190. And a little while back, they did actually do a bonus event where you were able to do four turns instead of three. Yes, I still do meditating woodlands. I know everyone has a go at me for doing this, but to be honest, how else are my heroes going to get EXP? Um, I don't, I don't uh, run adventures anymore. Uh, don't run dungeons anymore. So how else are my heroes? Skyland is actually going to get uh, uh, EXP. Okay, let's just make sure. Twenty-seven ten. Okay, two thousand less. Okay, I'll run 
one battle, I think you get something like 3,000 EXP for this. Uh, I think it's 3,000. Okay, we'll see once it's done. I'll put this back on board. Mm. Okay, let's see what we come up with. I think it's something like 3,000. 3,500. Yeah. So, two more runs, it'll be 7,000. Let's just see. Yeah, that's fine. I'll leave that on auto. Okay, I'll put this back on pause whilst I have. I don't know if... I'll, I'll show a little bit of this game code, so at least anybody wants to know what's it like. Um, <clears throat> We'll have a rough idea. There are certain game modes out of it in this that are okay, but this is more auto game mode. <laughs> in other words, you don't actually need to take part. You just put the heroes on. As long as they're uh, of a reasonable level, you could auto this no problem whatsoever. So they do have some nice features where you can do auto times 10, but in this case it's only auto times 3. Don't know why it says 1 of 10 on the top. Um, it should say 1 of 3. <clears throat> So there are certain game modes that are pretty good within the game and they do allow you to get EXP without you having to sit and keep watching the game. But unfortunately, one of the things come to us, too stupid to fail them out. Uh, for the life of me, I've got no idea why. Why can't they seem to understand that uh, for a game to be fun and enjoyable to play, you need to be able to offer your player base certain types of resources, certain types of heroes, in addition, certain types of game modes, um, which would, which the player base would be happy uh, taking part in. Okay, they brought in the uh, guild invasions, which at the time uh, everyone was really enjoying. Um, PvP was finally here, but to be honest. Uh, these days, the, the way it's been done, it, 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 it's been introduced in a very poor way. Um, so, um, I, it's not what it used to be, to be honest. They do need far more game modes um, to keep people active within the game. Because you'll see from this, I'll probably spend, like I said, about half an hour a day on this game. Um, that's all you need to do keep up with it. Dungeons, there's no point. If you want to, yes, auto a few dungeons, get a few ruins. Adventures, don't even bother trying. Uh, it's pointless. The only reason you might want to try one of the adventures um, is if there was an event on which gave you rewards uh, for allowing you or letting you do some of the adventures, uh, which there was one a little while back. But otherwise, forget about it. <clears throat> I'll just put this in pause and then uh, hopefully move on to the actual heroes themselves. This is going to be another long ass video. Sorry guys. Okay, that's all done now. I don't like the fact that you don't see how much EXP you've got for those heroes at the end of the year. Uh, the runs. Okay, that's basically all they've done. With my social again, and anything else I've missed out here. <sighs> Claim some of these mission rewards. Uh, okay, battle in a friendly battle. I don't really care. Purchase a wish stone, no chance in hell, not for 5,000. Enter the sort of dimensions, no thank you. And enter the range of five times, again, no thank you. And basically that's it. That is all I do in this game, and then I'd uh, end and quit it. Okay, but today's going to be different. Um, because we're, I'm going to be opening up some of those chests I've been holding on to, so please bear with me. Okay, let's get on to opening up some of these chests. So, what have we got at the moment? I've got uh, 
5,723,392 coins, gold coins, and 8,500 um, gems and 1585 energy. Okay. And this, all I'm really after are the uh, 30 young stars. Uh, let's see what we get. Sorry about that. Yeah, so let's see what I'll come up with. <coughs> Rares. Rares. <coughs> oh, please give me some other than rares. Rares. Right. I don't know what the odds are. Legendary. Oh, so it does. And you get these chests from the Dragon Nation. This is from the Large Tower. which you can do monthly. Again, from the large tower. Oh, that's fine. I'm happy with that. Obviously, I would love gold, but... Oh, great. I've got a gold one. Ember, brilliant. Kingpin. Kingpin. No, so... Not interested. Not interested. Spyro. I'm used to see it. Sundar, I think I've already got Sundar Max. Starfire is definitely Max. Thunderbolt, I've done and used. Food fight, that's fine. Another one I don't use. Pop is the useless hero. I don't really use. Obviously, I'd have to get two. Okay, let's just see what these come out like. Gold, oh nice. Will be pit boss. <sighs> what can you return it on pit boss instead? I'm slowly working on Gusto. Okay's favourite. I have to admit, I did laugh at Poke when he uh, started going on about Gusto. I thought, he hasn't got a clue what he's talking about. Wipe all your resources into Gusto. And now, <laughs> when Poke's actually quit the game, 
Gusto is actually quite useful. So, did Poke know something we didn't? something good. Oh my god, come on. Something, anything? Come on, come on. What does it have to do on heroes? I don't even use. No, I'm not him. Ah, oh, thank you, come to us. Go on, just keep going, yeah. Don't worry about it. Oh, again, oh, thank you. It's so kind. It's going to come up with. As you can see, the odds of getting a goal are very slim. Even a pink is very slim. Do that on people. No. What's that? No, don't do it on that. Well, I wonder if that's. I'll please do it on this one. And it would be zero. As you can see, you can get uh, one or two decent heroes. And the number of soul stones is pretty good. <coughs> oh, fine, it's someone decent. this character in the game. Okay. Typical. Not single gold. Nothing to use to me in that whatsoever. more useless here. Chain reactions, finally something decent. As you can 
see the odds of these things. Very strong, I don't think I'm watching it. The green is very tough on me. Sorry about that. Okay. So these are what you get from Lonely Soul, Lost Realm, or whatever it's called. So as you can see, you do get more soul stones, but in the past, you used to be able to get legendaries, and now, I think I've managed to get legendaries once from here. And if you remember in the past, you always got at least five or ten living soul stones. So the, the odds have reduced markedly. Oh, finally. Just, uh, no. So this is in the alchemy building, which is here. Now, I'm not sure where one of these maps. So you got uh, skill, Do all of these or that one? You're going to do all that.
Not this one. That one. Done. And you have chores done. Bring my own chores done. Quick clean my chores done. And I need to get 50,000. Okay, 12,000. 12,000. Oh, that's possible. Okay, so max that, max that, max that, max that, max those, max those, max those. I've got enough for a moment to take you. I'm going to go. Let's see what rubbish I get, shall I? Oh yes please, I want to exchange. Probably for another Zulu. <sighs> okay. Okay. Okay, so that's all done. That's all done. Yeah, final thing. Just going through my heroes. So Do all the stats. These are all maxed at the moment. Top and skills. I'll be powering them up. And I'll do that later. Actually, no. What if I do it now? At least six star. Okay, need to max as well now. I should have kept the 100 now. I've finally got enough to evolve my... Spitfire, is it? Yeah, Spitfire. Okay, let's Might hold off, might hold off for 10 minutes from now. I'd rather try and uh, evolve it. short soon.
has taken a while to do. I'll use it still. I don't know if I could do the same thing. Nah. Food fight, I do want to try and upgrade. It's a hero I'm not really working on, so. Sorry about this, I know it's quite boring. Just want to see who we can actually.
got some resources built in. Be away from here it's today. Been a good fun. Hold on. You can see these ones are running where I come from. I've still kind of got the last of mine and a couple other ones. Okay, that's basically it. Oops. Okay, uh, sorry for the length of this vid, I know it's quite a long one, uh, but thanks for watching. And like I said, my personal recommendation is definitely not to play this game. Not until they sort out the issues. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.